hey what's up guys welcome to my channel and in today's video we are going to talk about the ios 14.4 beta 3 release date and the ios 14.4 beta 2 follow-up so without wasting any more time let's get right into today's video shall we so the first thing we are going to talk about is home pod so ios 14.4 uh, i mean 3 is right now i'm running ios 14.3 on my home pod it is home pod os 14.3 or ios 14.3 you can call it whatever uh, Apple uh, have not uh, really named it so they just call it 14.3 so in 14.3 I already stated that in one of my previous videos I don't really remember but uh, I already stated it on my videos uh, I actually also stated that a Spotify update will be uh, I mean uh, a Apple have already made HomePod uh, possible to play with Spotify music and uh, that video is here you can uh, click here and uh, check that video out so HomePod can actually run Spotify music but Spotify needs to update their app in order to enable that feature so there is that uh, for the full info you can check this video out in the iCard now let's talk about IS 14.4 uh, beta 3 so today is by the time i'm recording this video the day this video is up is 18th of january uh, 2021 and uh, i think that we will see the beta 3 th uh, later this week hopefully uh, based on apple's previous trend it is uh, tuesday uh, and tuesday is the most expected day that apple releases the ios versions so i'm expecting that tuesday is the day that we are going to see the update anyways uh, I, if you don't really follow me on twitter let me show you guys uh, i actually posted this tweet here let me show you guys so i posted this that on my iphone 7 i was actually getting this bug here you can see that widgets were not really coming up and uh, this is a really annoying bug i just turned on my iphone 7 and i was seeing this i waited for some time i closed my device and turned it on again but this was not going no, go, going away i then uh, i ha i had to just turn off my device and then uh, i turned it back on i restarted my device basically and then i finally was able to use my device uh, without any hustle so there was that bug that i faced on my iphone 7 another thing is when i was connecting both of my airpods let me show you guys here are both of my airpods and when i tried connecting both of them together uh, yep do, people don't do these type of things but uh, i tried doing that but uh, for some weird reason my iphone just uh, was not responding and uh, got a spring out of nowhere so that was a bug that i faced on the is 4 beta 2 uh that that was it actually it didn't really brought any new things uh talking about the new feature the only new thing that i saw was if you will go here earlier you didn't had that wasted space now you do have that wasted space earlier it was uh, just ended here so there is some wasted space right now that was the only thing that i found here so now other thing was about the battery life so battery life talking about the battery life on my iphone 7 uh, right now it's 35 percent and uh, to be honest uh, iphone 7 on ios 14.4 beta 2 uh, in terms of battery till now it is performing like much better than ios 14.4 beta 1 and i expect that beta 3 of ios 14.4 will improve the battery uh, like a lot in terms of uh, the efficiency and all because right now it is much better than ios 14.4 beta 1 but it is still uh, not at the point when uh, ios 13 was out and uh, the battery life was really great of iphone 7 but it is still not at the point of that and if you look at my battery life right now it's 58 percent and it's and it's four o'clock right now uh, it means i am uh, in the middle of my day and uh, uh, right now i'm at 60 percent so so I think it is like not not a bad battery life at all but uh, if you will see here my uh, screen time is only 1 hour 40 minutes so uh, that concerns me but at the same time it is 
uh not bad because i started my day like at 84 percent so uh it actually concerns me a bit because on i use what in my full be uh beta one i was getting uh the same amount of battery life just a bit more better than this right now i'm ending my day uh at like 30 percent whereas early on beta one i was ending my day around 35 to 40 percent so it is like uh around 10 percent difference so that actually that actually actually worries me a bit but uh, i don't think so that's a big reason to do not update to beta two uh, if you are on Vita 1, I would say go ahead, you can update your device, it is uh, not at all, you are not missing on anything and Vita 3 is coming out and hopefully it will be much better than this, so this one where I am running it on my iPhone 7, I am running it on all of my devices, so be sure to subscribe to my channel and Vita 1 review on separate review on all of my devices are up, you can click here to check those reviews out, peace out and I will meet you all in the very next episode.